Say good morning. Say good morning, Maxwell. Who's that bird? Who's that bird? Hmm? It's Sunday morning, a little after 10. Maxwell and I are spending some quality time together, right? And um, he's all cuddly and puffy. It's hard to see him when he's this close. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. He said, scratch my neck, Mom. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Under his chin. Oh, that feels so good. Oh, that feels so good, doesn't it, Max? Doesn't it feel so good under there? Anyway, um, we, they're going to take, put, is the transmission on yet, or do they still have to put it on? They still have to put it on the shaft. Okay, so last night Pete talked at length to Ed, and the transmission is, he just said, still in the shop. There he is. Hi. And um, they're going to put it on and take it for a test drive today. So I got up, um, I'm cleaning cages, and cutting my bird. My Max, well, he's all puffy and cuddly. And uh, he's the only one out at the moment. So, because if I had Elliot out too, which the Elliot, Chloe, and Max usually come out together. But Chloe would be okay. But Elliot would be demanding my attention. And I want some time with Max today. Because Elliot usually is on, here, is on me, right? You don't get much time. So, I want to get back to work. I've got to get something out of the freezer for dinner. It's possible we could leave here today if all goes well, if they get everything put back together and everything works and test drive goes well. He's going to drive it on the roads and on the expressway because we're just a mile or so off I-94. So <clears throat> we'll see what happens. I know, Elliot. He's pacing back and forth on his perch and crawling. Aww. Came to a tractor supply for our pet food needs. It's laid out similar to ours at home, but bathroom's in the other corner. <laughs> and I found out that they have some excellent dog food, canned dog food, cheaper than what we've been buying for them at Walmart for when we're having a road. Cool, huh? Hi hey guys, we're just sitting in the car. They're still working on it. Found a couple more things he's going to take care of. Let's see, I'll put you there. We're sitting in our car because with somebody under it, I just don't feel right going in and out of our motorhome. With somebody under it, just in case. So, uh, today, let's see, we went out and, uh, let's see. I'll turn you guys around. There I am. Today we went out to Tractor Supply, as you saw. Got dog food, cat food, cat litter, uh, peanuts for Pete. They had a big can of peanuts for a good price. Uh, I forget what. And we asked them, and they let us uh, put our garbage in their dumpster. We asked their permission first, though, because our garbage has been piling up here. So, um, it's been piling up in our car because <laughs> we didn't have any place to put it. So they said we could dump it there. And then, um, we went over to Walmart and we needed a couple things there. I wanted to get a, uh, adapter for my headphones. My headphones have the, what size is it that I've got? Quarter inch jack. Uh, quarter inch socket. socket jack but my keyboard has a keyboard has a quarter inch which your headphones have an eighth inch okay my headphones have an eight inch eighth inch jack my keyboard has a quarter inch socket so I wanted an adapter so I could use my headphones with my keyboard because it's a very nice day today, and we've had all the windows open. I didn't want to play the keyboard with all the windows open. Because they're listening to their music right there and everything. So, 
However, they didn't have one, so... Um, I don't know if we're going to be leaving tonight anyway. I don't... I really don't know what's going on. Then we went to Wendy's and got a hamburger. Because I like their hamburgers better than anybody's. And strawberry lemonade. And then we went to... Um, the pub that we went to the other night and we got a gift certificate for the guides here because they've worked late. They've worked, I mean, it's Sunday evening or late afternoon anyway. I don't know what time it is, but they've been working all day. They worked all day yesterday. They have been really working hard to get us back on the road. So we went and got a certificate from that beautiful pub where we went to on Veterans Day and they have wonderful food there and we got a, so they can all go eat there. And then, um, because they've really gone above and beyond the co wouldn't you say they've gone above oh, and beyond? Yeah. Big time they have. <coughs> I mean, the owner Saturday night, he was here still at 9 o'clock, 9.30, whatever. I mean, they've just been... He's an honest man and yeah. doesn't cut corners and he does what needs to be done. And yep. If you see something wrong, he'll let you know, so that way you can decide whether you want to get it fixed or put it off or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they're they're really really good here. I can't. If you ever find yourself with transmission problems in Matawan, this is the place to go. Although it says up there they do complete automotive repair. It says on their door. So if you're ever in Matawan, Michigan, and you need complete automotive repair or transmission um, work, this is definitely the place to go. It was go. up in the 60s today. Imagine that November 14th, 15th, halfway through November, and it's in the 60s in Michigan. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> um, as much as I love snow, I have to admit this was a very beautiful day. All right, guys, I'm going to go. Just thought I'd check in. I wish I knew what time. What time is it? About 20 after 4. About 20 after 4. So, gorgeous day. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Just walking the dogs around out back. There's a motorhome up there. We're just back here in the parking lot. Walking around. Get some exercise. Right, boys? <laughs> yeah, he lifted his leg right out there in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> On the sand. He's such an excited boy. Yeah. This time change still has them all messed up because it's only 25 to 7 and they get fed between 7 and 7.30, but... Pharaoh's been on my case for half hour already. Oh, goodness. Okay, so, like I said, it's 25 to 7. Um, and I'm going to finish up here for the night. It's dark. But Sunday night, they're still over there working. We will be here until tomorrow. Um, they found something else that was a problem. I don't know if I already said this or not. If I did, I'll just delete one of them when I edit. Wouldn't you wash your fluid tank? Because he's going to get one of them for us, too. He is. I said my wife was going to mess with you. I just gave up. Getting... <laughs> yeah. He said, I'll go ahead and find a tank for you and put it on there. He said, winter's coming. You're going to need it. Yeah. We haven't had a windshield wiper or washer fluid tank in this. The other one that was in there would just fell apart. <laughs> I don't know why. So I was going to say, oh, yeah, and before we go, can you tap off our windshield washer fluid? But Pete ruined my joke, but he's giving us a new tank. He's putting another tank on there. You know, if you want to know something, you should just ask. Because tonight Pete um, uh, had noticed that we have a TV up there, and Pete said, well, you haven't used it because we don't have, you know, internet to burn or anything so and Ed said well, why didn't you say something he gave us the password he says I have unlimited internet use whatever you want you know so really all this time I could have had access but we didn't ask so if you want something you should always just ask I didn't want to you know presume I mean because we have used their water and we've used their electricity and their bathroom and um, and yes they are definitely earning earning our business they are just wonderful it's wonderful wonderful here so they're doing some real good work on this um, motorhome 
and they have an older motor home too and they get it they totally understand so you know he said yeah it may look bad you know on a ledger or according to the blue book or whatever but he said if it means it to you then you spend it and you get it done and you you know you use it for as long as you want to use it he said there's you know all the value in this motorhome isn't just according to what's in a book so he totally gets it this is our this is our home i mean i love this motorhome i don't want a different motorhome <laughs> but we've 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 put so much new stuff on that should last us a good long time Excuse me. So I'm going to go. Now I can upload vlogs tonight. I can watch vlogs tonight while Pete's watching TV because I have headphones so I can do it with my computer. And um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow we move. Tomorrow I also work at 930. I don't know until what, but looks like probably most of the day after I looked at the schedule. So it looks like I'll probably work most of the day unless something changes, which it always can. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. I hope you all had a wonderful weekend. Uh, we're supposed to have more beautiful weather in the forecast, so I'm looking forward to that. Hope you guys, I hope it's really nice where you guys are too. So take care. God bless. Good night.